I'm Eric Lee. Uh, I'm from Sydney, Australia. I'm the founder and trainer at Agile View. It's probably better to talk about Agile first. So Agile is a mindset, uh, an approach to work um, where it is very different from traditional processes. Uh, we value certain things more than others. Um, technically, it is a set of uh, four values and 12 principles. Uh, the issue is that a lot of the industry is changing um, and the world is changing. Uh, but the world still operates and companies still operate using the what's called traditional waterfall model to run their projects. Um, what a lot of the um, internet you know, companies and technology companies are finding out is that there are better things to, there are better ways to do this work and it is adopting an agile mindset. Um, my class usually consists of two days, uh, workshop style, um, training, um, it is definitely not lecture um, based. Um, there's a lot of games, a lot of questions and answers, and interaction with the team. Um, I like to present with a lot of examples from my experience, from what I've seen from different places around the world and different teams, different industries that I've seen. Um, but it is essentially two days. Um, I cover material from agile mindset, the values, the principles, and then we practice uh, a bit of uh, Kanban, uh, teach them about tasks and workflow, um, and then we move on to Scrum. Uh, Scrum has a lot more uh, processes involved and meetings, and so day two is mainly revolving around Scrum. I will go back to Agile. So Agile is beneficial to, um, actually you can use it in a lot of places. Um, a lot of people think that it is more IT based in computers and technology and programming, um, but in fact you can use this mindset in a lot of things. Um, I've seen it done in bakeries, um, in, in, in fact Agile came from manufacturing. Um, so it depends on how you want to apply it. So it is important that you know what it is, and you learn what it is so that you can find opportunities to go and apply it. Um, and then there are different ways to apply. You can use the Kanban system, you can use Scrum frameworks. There's different ways to approach um, the problem or the project that you have. But in general, um, you know, it's mainly used in IT and software development and programming, um, but I like to get out there and try and you know, convince people that you can actually use this in other industries. Um, and that's where it's most useful actually. In Jakarta I've done three. Um, I've also trained um, in-house as well a couple of times over here in Jakarta. Um, oh, I mainly train in Sydney, Australia. Um, I'm a Scrum Master and a coach um, inside a company, um, so I do that full time. Um, as well as running Agile View. Uh, so I do this regularly, about once a month at least, at a minimum. Um, well, I had opportunities in Jakarta in terms of helping um, companies um, adopt, um, becoming more agile, adopting Scrum. Um, and so I thought I'd come over here and from that contact I've met a lot of other interests and a lot of people. Um, and it looks like there is a lot of interest over here for this knowledge. Um, and I think with you know, where Jakarta is with the amount of population and the amount of work um, and the fact that you guys are advancing very quickly and developing very quickly, you know, there is, it's a very exciting place to be uh, for startups, for big companies to change, um, to go from a waterfall process to agile process. There is, it looks like there is uh, a lot of opportunities and, and, and it's a very exciting place to be.